morning, everybody. Say good morning, Cece. So, it is 9 a.m. Me and Chloe are headed to Hazard because um, our heat pump at the house, the filters for it, don't know what the deal is, but we have tried like, at this point, like six different filters, up-to-date filters and everything. It's like it's suffocating to pull the air through them. So, we gotta go back to what was there when we came, when we bought the house and moved in. It was those green filters. It's quiet with them. I mean, it catches the stuff obviously you have to change them once a month i've got to go find those we're gonna get this problem solved today i'm going to find those filters not only that my mom and dad will be in tomorrow for the week of thanksgiving super excited about that but my dad is diabetic and he needs sugar free i'm going to look while i'm down here at hazard at a few different stores and see if i can find him sugar free pie sugar free something else for thanksgiving maybe get him two things you guys are going to go look at the christmas stuff with us. Since we're going to be down there at uh, that Lowe's and that Super Walmart, we're all just going to go look at the Christmas stuff together. Right now, I'm going to get gas. I'm going to get this baby something to drink. If you guys are wondering where Colton is at, he is at his mamaw's. I asked him if he wanted to go to the store with Mama and Cece or he wanted to go to mamaw's and he said mamaw's. Let me show y'all one of my favorite combos. A hot pickled sausage and an L8. You just can't beat it. Would it really be a trip with me, you guys, if I didn't forget something? Luckily, I'm still in my town because I had to stop and get gas. You guys seen that. I got to driving when I pulled out and I was like, well, let me check the weather. My phone's at the house, so I'm sitting here. This is on top of our mountain where we live. The road after the flood broke off. I guess they've got it down to one lane or maybe they're up here working on it. I don't know. So me and Chloe and another car behind us, we're just sitting here waiting on this random light on top of a mountain to change that hasn't moved in five minutes. I gotta go back to the house and grab my phone. If I was by myself, I probably wouldn't care. I would just go on. But I got baby girl with me. And if I break down, anything happens, I will be calling her dad to come help us. I, I can't do that with my child. Not nowadays, unfortunately. So I'll be going back to the hacienda to get my phone. Then we go. I can wipe your face off. You're sticky. I ask them, would it be actual an actual trip with me if I didn't forget Absolutely something? Absolutely not. <laughs> All right, give me a good. All right, y'all. We are now going to Hazard. Let's go. Did you have a good sleep on the way down? You was catching flies. Her mouth's red from that sucker. I let her pick her one out at the gas station. Hi, baby. You ready to go in the store? You still waking up? What do you see? A marble. What's that? Oh, you see the Christmas trees? Oh, we're gonna go look at some Christmas stuff in a minute. First, we're gonna look at, uh, what's that? All the Pioneer Woman stuff. Oh, those are cute. Little Christmas tree dishes. Be jolly, that is cute. Okay, I hit the jackpot, you guys. I don't know why these are so hard to find. There is zero in our town at all. But I found them here and they're that's a four pack, it's six twenty eight, so that's a good price. So I got us enough for a year and in case like because ours is in the floor in the kitchen in case spills happen or anything, I got two extra packs because that has happened quite a few times. At least we have air filters for our heat pump for the next year covered at a good price. I'm happy with that price because some of the other ones online I was like Phew. and the shipping together. Well honey. Are you ready to go see the Christmas tree stuff? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, let's go. What'd you get? A me set, Ma. Did you get a new cup? Look how enormous these balls are, you guys. They're huge. They're so pretty, though. That is really cute. That's only $4.98, too. If only I had a green thumb. These are cute. These are really healthy, too. Sissy, look, gingerbread. Ooh, 
All the little drum sets. Those are cute. That's not a bad price. Tree. That's not a bad price either. So I think they have the Christmas stuff separated. There was some over there when we came in the door. This looks like mostly the trees and stuff, but I see like decorative pillows. So we're gonna go over there and look too. While I'm here, I'm just gonna go ahead and get wrapping paper for Colton's birthday. I don't wanna do like super Christmassy, but I'm thinking maybe that's still Christmassy, but it's all really Christmassy. So I don't think I'm gonna have, or I can just wait and look over at the birthday stuff. That would make more sense. It's a big bow, ain't it? <laughs> what is that, Sissy? <laughs> she looks really confused. My mom loves these. She used to have so many. I don't know if she still has them or not. Selfless plug, Walmart. So we landed in the gingerbread house section. Guys, Candyland. Check it out. They also got Sour Patch Kids. I thought that was cute. Oh my gosh. The peanuts. This one's $13 too. That's so cute. No, we're not opening it. No. Hey. So I'm over here in the bacon aisle. I've looked everywhere and this is what I found that's sugar free. Like that's sad. I feel bad for people that want something sweet. I mean, there's no options. He always ends up with this. I guess I'll get this brownie mix. I don't think he's tried these, but I'm gonna keep looking. But so far, that's what we're going with. Want to go get bye bats? Yay! Be girl. First mama daughter date lunch, I guess you could say. Hey, what are you gonna get? You want some fries and a burger? Wow. Wow. Ketchup. Hey, what are you gonna get for bye bites? Guess what they got? They got milkshakes. Ice cream? Yeah. <laughs> you guys, I am really missing my boy. I'm really missing my baby boy, but I know he's having a good time at Mamaw's. The reason Sean stayed home is because they're, the regular hoodies and shirts were coming and the tie-dye hoodie and shirts were coming, and he was waiting on those to be delivered this morning because they're out for delivery, so he can take them to Lori, so she can get them pre-treated and get started on them tomorrow, but that's why he stayed home. Colton wanted to go to Mamaw's, so. Just me and this girl having a good time, huh? Did you see the Christmas trees at Walmart? She's dancing to the music. <laughs> Where's Bubba? Is Bubba at Mamaw's? I'm sure she can't stand it. She is usually in a, a, a seat. Look how long her hair. If it wasn't curly. What? Bobo. Mama's at her house. You can't get on the table. You have to sit down. Cece, is that straw big enough? <laughs> the straw little. <looking. laughs> I guess they don't have kids straws. <laughs> All right, Chloe got grilled cheese and fries, and I got the steak burger <laughs> with ketchup. All right, you ready to eat? Uh -huh. Look how cute those are, you guys. I love how they're really cute. Okay, let's find the buggies. You ready, girl? You guys, look. I guess that could be for your door. It's flat right there. Look, you really put it anywhere. 
It's so cute. I love my Snoopy stuff. That's pretty much our whole Christmas Whoa, thing, ain't it? Where is the <gasps> What is all that? Okay, you wanna go see that stuff? looking at the Christmas mats so cute and then they've got this one that reminds me of like a vintage Christmas scene but I love this one it's only nine dollars it's cute you guys I would love to get Colton one of these for his birthday but I just don't know if it would survive I would have to put it up and I really don't have a shelf to set it on in his room Oh, actually, that might survive because it's all connected, but that's glass, so eh, I don't know if I should or not. I would love to get that for his birthday, though. Maybe next year or the year after when he's a little bigger and can understand he can't throw it because it's glass. <laughs> what did we find? Y'all better get it while you can. So I'm sitting here trying to find Colton a birthday present, like a small gift Sean Dunn got him. I'll have to show you guys. I'm gonna do a haul when I get home and show you everything I got. But Sean Dunn got him his big present, so I was just trying to like find. He still loves, he loves stuff like this still. It's like good sensory for him. He can sit down and play with it for 30 minutes. Like she's got this. think he would love that he would sit down and probably play with that for 30 minutes he still loves sensory stuff I mean he's just through he'll be four so mama's trying to find him a smaller gift too My husband can spot a Pizza Hut out a thousand miles away. We was on our way home and I called him like, are you hungry? And he's like, yeah, I want Pizza Hut. I had to turn back around. Thankfully, it was only about 10 miles out. Had to come get this man some Pizza Hut. We used to have one in our town for my whole life, my entire childhood. And then it closed down a couple of years ago and everybody misses it. Pizza Hut, please bring our Pizza Hut back. Our little town needs our Pizza Hut. But anyways, I got his pizza. We're heading home, and I'll show you guys the haul when we get there. I'm about to show y'all my chili. With winter quickly approaching, this is hands down the best winter comfort food you'll find anywhere. So come on, let's get into this. First, you're going to need some mater juice. You're going to need some black chili beans, some regular black beans, some kidney beans, and some mixed chili beans, a couple cans of Rotel, a couple cans of green chilies, can of mater, back there, can of mater paste, a couple cans of diced maters, some bone broth, a couple packs of chili seasoning, an onion, some ground beef, and some stew beef. Now the first thing you want to do is go ahead and put your big pot on the stove, add your mater juice. One can of your green chilies. One can of your Rotel. One can of your diced tomatoes. And go 
go ahead and add in your stew meat. Some pepper. And some salt. And we're just gonna let this all come to a rapid boil until that meat is good and tender and cooked up. Now on to the next step. Now we're gonna cut up our onion. Down a large pan, and we'll sweat off these onions some. Now that you got your onions cooked, go ahead and add your ground beef. Now add your beef broth. Now we're gonna bring this to a rolling bowl. We're gonna keep mashing this up and we're gonna basically just make like a, a meat paste, it, trust me. Now we're just gonna let this cook. Now that these are beginning to cook real good, you wanna take one pack of your uh, chili seasoning and add to your ground beef and beef broth. Allow this beef broth to start to cook down. This is gonna give you a little bitty bites of hamburger meat instead of them big old chunks. That's what the others is for. Go ahead and add your can of green chilies to this. Allow that to start to cook down. Then add a pack and your tomato juice. And then you just allow these to continue cooking. Now that this is starting to cook down, we're gonna add some tomato paste right directly in here. Mix this right in, it's gonna help it thicken up some. You can see there, now a lot of this moisture is already starting to cook out of this. Reduce the heat a little bit now. Like I said, this is a little longer recipe than my other one, so much better. But anything that takes a little longer is usually a little bit better. Now we're back at the big pot. We're gonna start adding all of our beans. And we're gonna go ahead and add the can of regular tomatoes. And then this, we're gonna add the rotel. Now we got that done, we're gonna move this into the big pot. Now we're just gonna let that sit there, simmer, slow cook for a while, and we'll be ready for dinner tonight. How's it smelling? It smells really good. Mmm, does, don't it? Yeah, it does. Does it smell nummy, buddy? No. It don't smell nummy. Are you sure? Sissy, why are you playing with your feet at the table? You got dirty toes from being outside? Shoo. Smell oh, like poop. Shoo! I get it! And there you have it. That's some of the best chili you'll ever eat. And that big recipe, you'll be able to freeze some, put some up, have some for later. Each day it goes by, this stuff gets better and better. Okay, you guys, we are finally home. Many, many hours later. But I wanted to show you guys the haul real quick, what I got. I showed you that at Big Lots. It was 16 something. I ended up getting it for $8, and it is so cute. I got that at Ollie's. I forgot to even take the camera in Ollie's because Chloe was asleep, so... And I got this cute little floor mat. And a dish drying mat, of course, with the red trucks on it. I got that little tree for like two bucks. Yeah, $2.97, just to set around the house somewhere. And I got these blankets right here. That's what this one looks like. But I got that one at Big Lots too, both of these, because it was um, two for $10. So I went ahead, because they were $8 normally. It was two for ten, so I went ahead and got those. Good and warm fleece. And I got that to go in the kitchen. That was from Big Lots, too, so that was just $8 as well. Really cute. And I got that for the kitchen. Just dish scrubber. I love my Charlie Brown stuff, but I love gingerbread stuff equally as much. But for the kids' sake, I obviously do Charlie Brown peanuts. But I got these window decals, the cleans. It looks, I think it has all that stuff right there. I'm going to put it on the big front window here. But this big, I don't know what it is, drapery or whatever. I might do that in the house or I might do it over a door. I don't know. But Chloe thought these were awesome. So I got that for a door. And I got us 
um, some holiday plates. That's pretty much it besides the peppermint candies and stuff in there. I'm out of breath because I just come in from outside with the dogs. And uh, I had to run one of my dogs halfway down the holler. They had went. But I got Colton's birthday supplies too. I went with Cocomelon because half the Paw Patrol stuff they didn't have. Like the banner, the cake topper, the napkins. So I went ahead. They had two of these cups. I got those for Colton and Chloe to have here at the house. But yeah, you guys will see that at his birthday party. Super excited about that. But that is my tiny little haul from today. Got really good deals on everything. I don't know what it is. The Christmas stuff is already 50% off. Now, I don't know if that's because they're moving last year's stuff out and they're getting ready to get more Christmas stuff or if it's because it's not selling as fast as they would have hoped and they've already got it at 50% off. It's like, I was kind of a little shocked. I think I ended up spending $92 almost on everything. And the great thing about it is I will have that for every other year to come. It's because like I said, I'll be, I'm, got, I'm going to get me two giant totes and I'm going to store these decorations properly this year so they don't get destroyed and mildew all over them and the little critters get into them. That way I don't have to buy this stuff again. I've got it, the kids will have it. Every year for Christmas, we can break it out and make them happy and mama too. I ended up getting them some bubble fruit too. I forgot. My kids love this stuff. Now, they don't have it at our normal little Walmart. The Super Walmart does, so I always get them a pack of the bubble fruit. It's got like those, I don't know if you can tell. Right there looks like one. It's just little, I'm not sure what they put them in, but they bust when you bite them. It's bubble fruit. I don't know. All right, you guys. It has been a long day. It's 10 o'clock at night now, <laughs> but he came home from his mamaws and I had to get them fed, get them something to drink. Um, I bought them the little Christmas elf hat ears and stuff. So they had a ball with them for a few minutes and they're slinkies, they got slinkies. I decided to wait on getting Colton's other birthday present until my parents will be here tomorrow so me and sean will go we've got five more days so me and sean will go either this weekend or monday or so and go pick out his smaller birthday present and maybe do a little christmas shopping for the kids and we'll store it up in the building or the old shop building up there until christmas but there's a lot of sales going on right now, like Black Friday is almost here. And a lot of places like Walmart has already got a ton of their Black Friday sales going on. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video shopping with me and Chloe. You're in my way. I'm tired. He's very tired. He's doing his clean, yearly cleanse. It cleans your colon out. It's actually really, we're supposed to do that at least once Mine's a year, a I think. But, um... You know, Sean's 42 years old and he's like, That's your he's like, I need to do just a full detox, clean my colon out. It cleans your gut out. But uh, so far he's had not like felt bad or nothing. It's just been, it cleans your colon out. So you have to go to the bathroom. But I done one years and years ago. That's what it does. It runs you to death to the bathroom, but you feel better for a while, for sure. Side note, there is Christmas shirts up on the website now. We only got three up today because the power got cut off for a little while. It was being worked on. We got a bunch more Christmas shirts that are gonna be out on the website this weekend. It is time, make sure you guys try to get those orders in if you want one. Have it ordered by December the 1st, Christmas shirts. The 1st to the 5th. That way you can get it in time for Christmas or if it's a Christmas present, try to have it in. We have to have a two week processing window. You guys, that's just, that's what works best for us. Order capacity is what it is. It, we try to stay two weeks, two weeks, two weeks. And that's been a good flow. But here's for the thing, we're at about, at the moment, eight days. Some of them are sooner. It just depends, you know, on how quick we can get stuff in that we can get it back out. We're doing really good right now. Ben, Hopefully you we showed can them stay. the tree. I was saving that for tomorrow. It's just a little bit. Hope you enjoyed the video. My babies are in the bed. I know you guys are going to miss Colton saying bye and Chloe doing her little bye sneak peek. I'm going to bed. 
I love y'all. Stay positive, stay country, stay true to your roots.